Hey guys, today I'll be playing Aggro Rogue vs. Gara on Shaman. It used to be one of the hardest matchups for Aggro Rogue, but since Aggro Rogue started including Cold Light Oracles, which is Backspace's innovation, it's uh, really helped the matchup a lot. So now it's I'd still say the Shaman is slightly favored, but I'd say it's at least uh, uh, Rogue has at least 45% chance to win, especially if you draw the Cold Lights at the right time. Um, and it really depends on the Shaman getting the Feral Spirits, and sometimes they even need two Feral Spirits pretty early on or else they won't be able to catch up, because with the Cold Lights, you'll both have like full hands, but the Shaman just can't efficiently spend his mana as well as you can with all these one-drops. The deck is uh, really based on just efficiently spending your mana with just a ton of cards. That's why there's so many one-drops. Sometimes this deck will include a ba one backstab to help with Zoo, but uh, against a Shaman, two saps is definitely better, because the Shaman actually needs to get minions on board to do damage with their Flame Tongues and whatnot. And it's really hard to get the Doom Hammer on too, so to get damage out, they really need to get like their Fire Elementals on the board, and they need to get Argus targets, so Sap will help prevent that. Otherwise, everything else is pretty much the same. Mukla's pretty good. Um, yeah, especially if you can get him out the earlier, the better. And then Assassin's Blade is amazing. And just one Blade Flurry for now. So yeah, we'll head into the games.